Welcome back to the channel everybody. This is Nick the Kid here with another fishing related video. This is uh, going to be a short video about uh, some Walmart purchases that I got uh, just Friday after work. I went to Walmart and I got some new fishing lures to add to my arsenal and my tackle box. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what I got and I bought all of this. Um, that I'm going to show you right now. I bought all this for just a little over 20 bucks and I thought it was a pretty good deal. I liked what I saw and I liked what I picked. So if you guys have any of these uh, in your tackle box as well, uh, I would love to see pictures if possible of posts that you've caught whatever type of fish you've caught i'd like to see some pictures in the comments down below so please consider subscribing and give the thumbs up on this channel to help out the algorithm and stay tuned for all of my future fishing videos and let's get into these lures all right so first up top i'm gonna do a pan out here so you could see so we've got two uh mini strike king uh spinning lures up top we have a flicker shad here it's blue we've got a rooster tail here we have a rattle uh basically like a rattle mini rattle crankbait right here and then we have some barrel swivels that i got these guys work really cool because you tie the one end right here to your fishing line and then this end like you pinch it pops open and then you could swap out your uh, bait super easy you don't have to cut and retie your line every time you swap out bait so highly recommend this um to anybody because it just makes your fishing a lot more consistent and quick to swap out your uh stuff Instead of having five, six fishing poles with you, you could essentially only have one, depending on what type of fish you're fishing with for the for the day. But uh, if you have one universal rod, you know, you could pretty much swap out whatever bait. So that stuff's really good. All right. So we're going to go over this first one here is the um, blue and the chartreuse yellow green uh color strike king this guy is in that initial first bass video that i caught with a three pound bass that is with this exact mini strike king um i caught that with this but i ended up buying this one again today because the first one that i caught shortly after i caught that bass i got it caught in the rocks and i wasn't able to get it out and then pfft, then it just snapped my line off in the rocks. So I had to buy a new one of that because this has worked well for me. I caught a three pound bass and then another two and a half pound bass off of that lure. So I ended up getting another different spinner this time. So this other one is black and like dark navy blue with glitter. It's got the same silver spinner there. So that's cool. These guys work really well for bass. I have not caught any bluegill or crappie yet on these. But I think it's just because the bite for those types of panfish haven't been hitting yet. At least not on my lake at this point in time. But hopefully very soon. Next we have the Flicker Shad 5 from Berkeley. And this just really caught my eye. I'll show you kind of with the light here. It's super cool with that metallic ocean blue color. Super cool. I think, and it's got that lip so it dives down. I think this is going to be amazing for bass and for walleye. And maybe even some, you know, maybe some perch and bluegill too. But, um, I mean, hey man, whatever goes for this I'm, I'm down whenever my line is hit i'm reeling it in no matter what it is next we have our uh classic rooster tail this is probably the most universal bait that you can throw out there rivers creeks ponds lakes any kind of water conditions practically you could catch fish with a rooster tail um and the rattle trap 
So it's got the mini guy. I do have another one exactly like this in my tackle box from my other tackle box videos, if you've kept up with my channel. But I do have one like this. Like I said, this is the mini one. But I have the other one that's like twice as big, if not three times. So it's like this big, but like that. So it's a little bit bigger version. And then, so this one, you know, is good for pretty much any kind of pan fish. So I'm excited about that. And we got our barrel swivels. So I got plenty of these because I've lost a few last year. So at least I got a bunch of them now to back up if I ever lose them out again. But again, if you guys have any of these, let me know. Um, check out my other fishing videos as well on the fishing tab. But anyway, if you liked the video, please hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button down below. And have a good time, fun fishing this season. And remember to get out there, get those lines wet, and remember about that hook set. Alright, thank you guys for watching.